How's it going guys, CB7 here, and today I'm going to be doing a play review on Inform Mate. And before this review starts, if you're new to the channel, then please subscribe, I would really appreciate it, and let's get on to the review. Now Inform Mate is a center mid from Liga, and he is from France. He's six foot two. he has medium high work rates, and he has 3 star weak foot and 2 star skill moves. Now I did pick this card up for 24,500 coins. But his card has dropped insanely in price since I have bought him. You can now pick him up for around 18,000 coins and it may even drop after that. So now into his in-game stats, some of his standout stats are 88 short passing, 89 long passing, 85 ball control, 81 heading accuracy, 84 standing tackle, 86 stamina, and 88 strength. Now I decided to review this card because a lot of people are wondering if this card is an upgrade to Bakioko, and I can confirm, yes, he is, but slightly. He has similar stats to Bakioko, and I feel that his card is better. Now the pros for this card were obviously this guy's strength. On multiple occasions, he was able to knock people off the ball with ease, and I also feel like his tackling is very, very good as well. As you can see in some of these clips, he performs some very good slide tackles and stand tackles on my opponents. And his interceptions are also very good as well. He reads the play so well, and he is able to pick multiple passes off that my opponents do. I also feel like his passing was very, very good as well. Center mids ultimately need good passing in order to get the ball up to the forwards. And yeah, he basically made some very solid passes for my team. Now onto the cons. I did feel that he was a bit slow, just a bit, okay? Obviously, a player like him that's strong and has good passing doesn't necessarily need to be the fastest, but at times I did feel that he was a bit slow and wasn't able to catch up with my opponents. Also, his dribbling is not what it suggests on the card. He did feel very sluggish on the ball. I think that has to do with the fact that he is 6'2", but generally I just didn't think his dribbling was good. Now, obviously his shooting, yeah, it's, it's absolute wank, okay? It's so bad. With all the other stats that he's got, it doesn't really matter if he has good shooting or not. And the last con for this card would have to be his positioning. I did feel multiple times he was positioned correctly, but a lot of the time he just wasn't there when I needed him to be. And also, because of this guy's work rates, he tends to stay back more and doesn't tend to get up the field, which is something much different from Bakioko. Bakioko will constantly play more attacking and then play more defensively. But this guy just didn't seem to do that, which I didn't really like about the card because I kind of like when center mids do that. But I think if you played this guy at CDM, he would be an absolute god. He has the stats that will make him a good CDM. I didn't try him out at CDM, but if you buy him and if you do, then I think he will perform amazingly. But overall, Informate was a very solid center mid. I do feel like he's a very good card and a slight upgrade to Bakioko. If I had to rate this card out of 10, I would give him an 8 out of 10. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Hopefully this influences you to buy this card or not buy this card. Please check out the other reviews that I did on my channel today. I did one for Second Inform Peterson and one for Inform Visca. If that's how you say it, I don't really know. I really appreciate it if you went and checked out those videos. The link to those will be in the description. Please subscribe if you're new and yeah. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video.